Michael Jordan has taken a bold step in the motorsports world, standing up against NASCAR with an antitrust lawsuit that has the potential to reshape the racing landscape. The 2-3 XDI Racing Team, co-owned by Jordan, recently filed the suit alongside Front Row Motorsports, alleging that NASCAR operates as a monopoly through anti-competitive and exclusionary practices. The core issue centers around NASCAR's charter system, a franchise-like structure that guarantees certain benefits to teams. Jordan made his views clear before the recent race at Talladega Super Speedway, stating, I wouldn't have filed it if I didn't think I could win. Jordan's team argues that the current system disproportionately benefits NASCAR at the expense of its racing teams, limiting their ability to grow and succeed financially. 13 of the 15 team owners signed a new charter agreement with NASCAR last month, but 2311 Racing and Front Row Motorsports were the two holdouts. For Jordan, this legal battle isn't just about his team, it's about fairness across the board. We want a fair deal, Jordan emphasized, underscoring that the lawsuit is about advocating for all teams, not just his own. Denny Hamlin, co-owner of 23X.I Racing and one of NASCAR's top drivers, is juggling this legal battle while competing in the NASCAR Cup Series playoffs. Despite the lawsuit, Hamlin remains focused on his championship pursuit, stating, you just need to prepare the best you can and do the best you can on Sunday. Hamlin's mindset reflects his determination not to let the legal drama interfere with his racing performance. His confidence is backed by solid preparation and a focus on ensuring his team performs at its highest level, even amid the chaos surrounding the lawsuit. NASCAR, on the other hand, has remained largely silent on the matter. Chairman and CEO Jim France declined to comment when asked about the lawsuit, focusing instead on the ongoing championship battles. The lack of public response from NASCAR only adds to the uncertainty surrounding the future of the sports business structure, especially as the court date approaches. The lawsuit could have far-reaching implications for NASCAR, potentially altering how teams are funded and how much control NASCAR holds over the sport. For Jordan, this fight is personal. He's a businessman and competitor who isn't afraid to challenge the status quo if he believes something is unjust. As he pointed out, this legal battle is about more than just winning races. It's about securing a fair future for all teams involved in NASCAR. Hamlin echoed Jordan's sentiments, adding that the lawsuit should be viewed as an opportunity to bring positive change to the sport. He referenced a scene from the movie Moneyball that resonated with him. The first guy through the wall always gets bloody. It's a statement that underscores the risks Jordan and Hamlin are taking by going up against a powerhouse like NASCAR but it also reflects their belief in the necessity of this fight. As this legal battle unfolds, it remains to be seen how it will affect NASCAR's future. With the potential to shake up the sports foundation, Jordan and Hamlin are pushing forward, confident that they're on the right side of history. One thing is certain, this fight is far from over, and both Jordan and Hamlin are fully committed to seeing it through. Stay subscribed for more videos.